now we will come to the second part of the configuration we have to note down the some of the settings that will be required in uh, configuration you can see that I have already written the uh, setting in the one part the setting I have been uh, used for my previous uh, uh, router setting and uh, the same uh, will be used for the next rest uh, with a bit little bit uh, uh, changing first we have to enter the host name I used this and uh, we have to change the administrative password to log the have a plugin and uh, please do remember it because it is has to be used for login to the uh, web uh, interface and if you next that you do not use dot it is giving the hand uh, indicated below so just change it from dash from dot dash and then it should be fine I'm going to change it here you have to enter the mesh network name so I have only um, created a mesh on the previous access point so I want that um, this will also be a part of that mesh to the channel and my previous mesh and this mesh should have the same channel and I use the encryption so here I have also to use the same password so that the mesh can be encrypted just confirm the password and you have to create an access point the access point name channel and uh, if the user uh, you want that the user should also be scaled so you have to enter the password as well I give some of the uh, notation on my wireless mesh the channel should be the same and enter the password as well so so that the user connected to the secure wireless and you can make it open as well and that depends on your choice Confirm it. Oops, little bit error. Correct it. Next. And we are done. The setting uh, for the gateway, and uh, you can. 
the CT configuration that will be updated in the text form. Just save and apply and then to reboot the access point. So we have to log in it again to see the configuration. Now we need to log in it again. Now it will ask you the password that we have entered in the configuration. Here it is in the you can see the web interface currently no other uh, node is connected so we will see the other configuration in the next video tutorial so stay tuned And thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel.